show you the different ways that we use messages. But I'm going to kick things off by jumping first into a thread with my sister Lori, who just got to a graduation. So let's write her back and say, give her my love and tell her I said happy graduation day. Okay, now typically I would hunt for the perfect emoji to tap on the end, but now when I tap on the emoji button to switch to the emoji keyboard, words throughout my message that can be swapped for emoji are automatically highlighted. And all I have to do is tap to replace them. So I'm going to tap to replace love, and I'm going to choose the type of hearts I want to send. I'm going to do bedazzled, I think. And I can tap on happy, and I choose how happy I want to be. What do you think? Uh, why don't you go with the upside down? Meh, no. Okay. I'm gonna, yeah. Hey, you be you, Bethany. You be you. I'm going to do eyes closed, kind of happy. And I tap on graduation, and I switch this to the cap, which there is no chance I would have found that. None. We would have been here for days. True story. So I'm going to go ahead and send that off. So Lori just sent through a digital touch video, and what's so awesome about this is that she created this entire thing using digital touch right from within messages. And it's so much fun to make, aren't they? Yeah, and really, really fun to watch. And I'm going to let her know how I feel about it using tap backs, which is as easy as double tapping and sending back a heart. It's that quick and that fun, and honestly, it is my favorite way to communicate now. So Lori says she can't wait to see me this summer, and I feel the same way. So I'm going to let her know. I'm going to say, me too. And I'm going to send this using a bubble effect. So I just press and hold on the send button. And I think gentle will really let her know how I'm feeling. So I'm going to choose that one. Uh, so great. All right, so. <laughs> that sounded a little sarcastic, I think. Well, I think Lori felt it, that's yeah. for sure. Um, so, now the both of us are going to show you just how fun things have become with a group of friends. I'm going to go in and uh, revive a chat here by sending a digital touch photo. Now, Bethany just showed us how fantastic those digital touch videos look. Let's take a look at how easy it is to make one. I'm just going to launch the camera here. You want some space up here? Yeah, just a bit. It is a process, you know? Hold on. All right. I'll pick a color. Let's say, what do you think of the color? Yellow. Yellow. All right. Now add my usual shout out and send. It is that easy. It looks good on the big screen. <laughs> hey, it looks like Freddy's here and as usual, loud and always ready to talk about some music. And he sent over an Apple Music link. And what's great about these is I can just play them right in line without ever having to leave my conversation. It's simply the best way to share music. Let's give it a listen. CD sound system always sounding so good, especially at Bill Graham. Um, Anne seems to agree, and she said so using a handwritten message. And these things are always so personal, always so fresh. Let's write back and say they smashed it. And I'm going to do so sending a uh, bubble effect. I'm going to choose my favorite, which is Slam. Bam, always gets my point across. I think you've used that one a little bit. You know what? It never gets old, yeah. right? 